name is Sloan and welcome to this week's Fit in 15. All right, it is crucial that you do a warm up before you start your drills. There's a lot of jumping, tuck jumps, all kinds of good stuff. So I really need for you to make sure that you warm up. If you don't want to watch that video I have on my website, do a minute of squats, do a minute of deadlifts, do a minute of burpees, do a minute of push-ups, do something, five, four or five minutes of that, and um, that way you're ready for when all the good stuff comes. All right, drill number one. One of my pet peeves, get down, work your legs. Don't do it up here, that's not gonna help you. Sink down nice and low, tuck your tailbone under. You're gonna reach over your ear, so don't cut it off, don't twist your torso. Reach so you engage your lats, have that other elbow by your hip. You're gonna pull it in, you gotta use your arms, your feet are gonna stay this wide, tuck jump. Reach and tuck, that's it for one full minute. Now, it's a tough one, it ain't easy. So if you're starting to fatigue towards the end and you're really losing your form, you're gonna reach, high knee, come down, reach, high knee. Remember, you've got five sets. <laughs> so pace yourself, keep good form, it's really, really important. Drill number two, I'm not calling this a burpee. It's a jump squat with a triceps push-up. I will give you modifications, don't worry. You're gonna start down again. Fingertips are down, you have a nice flat back. Let me show you from the side first. So your gaze is out here. You're gonna push through and slow through those heels. Press back, bring your hands in nice and narrow. Kick back your elbows by your rib cage, drop down. You never come up. Press, hop down, push up from the front, looks like this. So you're gonna press, hop down, push up, back up. Now, modifications. You can press on your toes, come down, hold a plank. Still stay low. Press up, come down, hold a plank. Okay, so you can do any variation between those two. Um, you could do the jump with just a plank. You could do no jump and do the push-up. Whatever works. All right, starting this month, because it's been a year, we're gonna switch up the free weights and change it to a kettlebell. So, if you're a woman, lady woman, I suggest about 10 pounds, because the drills are a minute, they're very explosive movements. If you're a man or male, 10 pounds are up depending on your fitness level. So this is one of the basics. It's called the kettlebell swing. You have good posture. You explode through your heels and your hips. All right, so you're gonna swing it through your legs, bring it back up, and that's it. It's just a big swing. Now what you're not doing is arching your back or letting that kettlebell fall behind. You keep it pointed straight up and you let it swing. You use your hips. It's very important to use your hips on this, but what you're not doing is dropping your head down in between. So keep your eyes up. Okay, so you're gonna go one minute here. Make sure you exhale your breath on the big swing up. All right, third and final drill. More jumping, folks. Switch lunges and a squat, looks like this. All right, so start with your hands up. So you're gonna do a switch lunge. You're ready to turn, turn to the side. Turn back, switch your lunge, turn to the side. So that's it, one minute. Just keep switching and turning. Now, again, if you get fatigued towards the end of the minute and you feel like you're losing your form, if you can hear, come back. If you needed to step up instead of jump, fine. But if you're trying to reach your maximum heart rate, that's the goal, it's cardio. All right, those are your three drills. Have fun.